you about this storm for days now. It's here. High winds, snow, dangerous conditions in our area. The Valley Today's Brian Sherrod. He has been covering road conditions all morning and he joins us live right now with what it's like. Brian, where are you and what's it like out there? Well, good morning, Jordan. 19th Avenue North is where I am. So pretty much by the Hector International Airport and the Fargo Dome. And look at these temperatures or look at this weather I should definitely say I mean the wind is blowing pretty hard you can definitely hear it you can definitely also see it as well looking across the roadways just seeing it just going quickly we are seeing a lot more cars than normal that actually did surprise me since I know we were saying to not travel unless you need to so hopefully these cars are either going to work or going to a destination that they need to this morning but what I do want to show you is across the street, you can see this tractor just shoveling up all of this snow that's already piled up so that way you're able to safely travel, at least in that part of the area. He's been out there for about 10 minutes now clearing the parking lots of the McDonald's and the Chipotle across the street. You know, again, when you're looking in front of you, you really cannot see that far ahead. So cars that are traveling can't really see that much in front of them because I know even looking ahead myself, you can't see that much. But what I want to also tell you, the Hector International Airport, if you do plan on flying out of there, there's a lot more cancellations that came across in the last 10 minutes and they are as follows. So make sure you're paying close attention. Now, Minneapolis, that was a 6 a.m. flight that is canceled, so they're not doing that flight right now. 7.30 to Chicago, 9 this morning to Denver, 10.34 to Chicago, and also 11.56 to Denver as well. They are all canceled. Now, there are a few that are delayed, and there are some that are still saying they're going to be flying on time. We'll keep you updated with those as it comes in. But again, don't travel unless you absolutely need to. You know, it is pretty cold out here, which you can definitely tell, but these winds are very, very strong. So again, if you do have to travel, be extra cautious. Some good advice out there. Brian Sherrod, stay safe on this Wednesday morning.